in this video, we're going to cover an approach to building measures and how you should think about your measures beforehand to reduce the amount of waste and time you are developing measures, become more efficient and, and really get the most out of your time within Power BI. Hey guys, this is Hayden from Connect. Thanks for tuning in. So, so as we said at the outlay, this is about how to structure and layer your measures and how to become more efficient in your building of your data model and your measures. So I've got my data model here. What I want to do is I've got my orders that has the product quantity. I've got my product price in the products table here and my actual cost, which is in my shipments, the cost of the delivery of that product. So I want to work out the total cost, um, sorry, the total revenue minus the total cost to get my profit. So let's jump into a measure, right? And this is I'm just going to go through an example, probably how not to do it. So if I just hit new measure, um, so like I say, not how not to do it, but then I'll show you the best way to do it to just get you thinking about the best way to approach. So I've got my measure. Uh, I've already I've already typed it out. So say if you're watching, you tippy tap on the keyboard. There you go. So now I have my total profit measure. Let's drag that into here. So now I have that here. Put it in the card. 3.1 million. So at some point I'm going to want a measure that tells me what my total revenue and total cost was. So I've already got those built here. So here's total cost and here's total revenue. So these are the same calculations I've just made to my total profit. So what, what really I should have done although I did do in this one, but what, what you should focus on when building your measures is to build up your simple, your base, your early measures at the very start. So this will be total revenue, total cost. So I'm allowed to, so I've now just put a measure within a measure to generate that profit. Now, so much simpler, I've not had to duplicate anything, I've not had to recreate anything. And that's it, that's all this video is, it's a quick one, it's really to show you um, the best way to optimize your time and how to build up your measures and structure, structure your data model properly. Thanks. If you're just finding us for the first time, please hit subscribe, hit that like button if you enjoyed it, and I'll catch you next time.